third winter storm in less than a week is slamming the south coast at this hour. A mix of snow and ice pellets have created treacherous driving conditions, leading to some major road closures today. Good afternoon. I'm Colleen Christie. Thanks for joining us. We begin with those closures in the lower mainland. Both the Portman and Alex Fraser bridges have been shut down due to dangerous driving conditions. Our Jasmine Bala joins us live from Surrey with more. Jasmine, the conditions appear to be getting even worse. Yeah, Colleen, it's getting really ugly out here. There's snow on the roads and highways. We've got freezing rain in the mix now, and we're starting to see the impact. Now, the province did warn us that we might be seeing um, highways closing at a moment's notice, and now we've got two major bridges completely shut down. Alex Fraser and Portman are closed in both directions. Detours are in place. They've closed off this stretch of Highway 1, leading to the Portman rerouting drivers off exit 50. The Portman is closed because of the risk of falling ice. The Ministry of Transportation says the freezing rain has caused ice to accumulate on the bridge cables. It's been slow going for commuters as drivers navigate slippery, icy conditions. Snow plows are out across Metro Vancouver, but the snow is falling faster than they can clean it up on major routes. And road conditions are treacherous. When you throw freezing rain into the mix, it becomes even more hazardous. And we are starting to see ice pellets and freezing rain rainfall, but the Fraser Valley and Vancouver Island are the places that will be hardest hit, and it could continue falling there for up to 36 hours. The weather we're seeing will create dangerous road conditions through the province, and we're already seeing that along with potential power outages. As for what's being done to address it, the province says its maintenance contractors will be out in full force today clearing the roads, but so far they're playing a lot of catch up as many routes remain covered in white. Freezing rain can coat our highways in ice and our maintenance contractors are fitting many of their vehicles with ice blades to cut through any accumulation as ice is very tough to manage. In the interest of safety, we may close highways if necessary with short notice. I know people have plans for the holidays. They want to spend family time with family, friends and loved ones. But this is a significant weather event. Snow followed by freezing rain and then rain. I think this is the worst, you know. This is the worst you've seen? Yeah, so yeah. far, you know, in my last 40 years in Canada. The message from the province is clear. One day before Christmas Eve, do not travel unless you absolutely have to. And it seems people are heeding that message. There are fewer drivers out on the road today than usual. And as, as for this bridge closure, there is no timeline for when it will reopen. Back to you. All right, Jasmine, thanks so much.